Hello everyone, a long time since the previous update. I had three work trips in a row and also moved, so I have had a lot on my plate recently. Now I have more time to work on the game and also in the future, and my hopes of creating a playtestable alpha version in the summer is quite possible. A couple of things I've been working on are the disaster system, which I'm not really sure I want to include in the end, basically like fire and uh, hull breach and stuff like that. And also a tile builder system so that the player can expand or create their own spaceship. Some bigger problems here are the oxygen system and pathing system which require quite a lot of work. Uh, so they can be made but uh, are quite difficult to tackle. I've also polished the graphics and added button graphics for the buildings in the UI. But let's jump into the matter at hand, the logo and the title text. I finally created the title text and logo for Generation Nova and here is how the process went. A little bit of background first. Anyone who has ever done graphic and art with text has run into the problem that all the good fonts are not actually royalty free even if they tell they are 100% free. There are a, lot, a couple of things to take into consideration. Quite many of the free fonts are not allowed to be used in games or apps or such. I just couldn't find a good font so I decided to create my own version by taking inspiration from a couple of different fonts and ended up with this. For the logo I first googled different keywords like sci-fi logo and generation logo to get a feel for what I wanted. I also wanted the logo to feel and look like nothing I've ever seen before so it was a good thing to google some major games I've played so that I wouldn't accidentally copy their logo or title text work. A friend of mine told me the text gave a bit of a Mass Effect feeling, so I had to check whether I was copying it or not. Fortunately, it was the latter. I wanted a couple of things in the logo, a planet or something that could resemble a planet, and also the blue color. I also thought about some kind of an embryo or cell or whatnot in the middle to depict the generation idea, but ended up scrapping that. I didn't want the logo to be too fiddly and small with details and stuff like that. So there, are, these are all the things I played around with and finally ended up with this. I believe this would have been better made with vector graphics software since I had to redo the logo after I had done it already because the original canvas was only 1500 by 1500 and I ended up creating a 4k re uh, logo in the end so that I could use it in any way I wanted basically just to um, downscale it. The same goes actually for the text so I basically did it twice. Now for the layout, I asked Reddit and a couple of my friends on which of these looked the best. The layout was a bit of a problem since letter A in Nova doesn't work the same way as some more blocky letters. Uh, but the third one here was the best one in the end, I think. The outline and beveling are things that I will be changing depending on where I'm using the title text. Like for example in an intro screen it might be a bit more 3D looking with a hazy background glow, but in a more promotional art like the Steam pop-up uh, I wanted to be sharp and crisp. So here is my process through the logo creation process. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.